Hello there, this is Michelle Knights and I'm coming to you from Mausel in Cornwall, which is a stunning little harbour town. My face still isn't fit to be seen, but it is getting better, so thank you for all your kind words. Here is your incredible weekly astrology. We have a fixed Grand Cross and a Grand Fire Trine to bring us up into our passion and make us break through any pesky patterns that have been holding us back. Aries, this week Mars is on the move and it's shifting into a position for you that softens you up and opens you up to your spiritual awareness. You've got great insight, you've got great intuition and you can really tune in to the softest part of yourself. On the other hand, the other side of this is you may find yourself tempted to lose yourself in some way and to do a bit of escapism. So watch out for that because due to other things occurring this week, you have to be on top form because there's a chance of great transformation. We have a fixed grand cross. This is very intense, but we've been through worse things last year and basically this fixed grand cross is teaching you how not to be fixed and how not to be dogmatic particularly when it comes to emotional relationships there may be feeling stirred this week of jealousy intensity primal emotions but actually this grand cross is saying stretch yourself cast out your dreams be the best version of yourself that you can possibly be allow yourself to let go of the small stuff to not reacting at anger but instead allow yourself to be a creator and a spiritual warrior of love. The Grand Fire Trine on the 18th is filling you with excitement and it's saying to you, now is the time to go forward. Don't hold yourself back. Open up to life's possibilities, particularly when it comes to joy, pleasure and creativity. Your higher self is really whispering in your ear this week. So make sure that you listen it's a time of passion, it's a time of movement and it's a time for you where you understand whether you're male or female, actually the power of the feminine to use your strength not in an active way but by to use it with gentle quietness and joy. There should be also some extreme feelings and connections and almost telepathic love feelings for someone. So it's very passionate, it's very steamy but it has great opportunity for evolution of spirit. Take care and I'll speak to you soon.